Hi, this is our setup for RL78 based two phase BLDC motor fan speed control. Uh, so, this is the fan, it's running. This is the controller, and uh, we are sensing uh, three analog signals the supply voltage and uh, the coil voltages the two coil voltages of the two phases and uh, we are generating pulses for making on or off the two coils so these two outputs and these are the three ADC signals that's the ground and this is the board uh, driver circuit having two transistors uh, which are turning on or off the two coils and one op amp for level shifting because RL78 generates 3.3 volt pulses and uh, this op amp compares them with a uh, uh, mid voltage of 3 volt and generates a pulse of 12 volt 12 volt is the supply voltage so those pulses are fed to the base of the two transistors two PNP transistors and uh, they are connected to the coils this is our DC coming and here is the fan wires feeding the two coils when common uh, common voltage and uh, the two coils connected to the common voltage and the coils are turned on by making them to ground so this is our motor running now if I stop it it should start automatically from zero speed ideally but so far we have been implemented here it is able to start As the motor uh, uh, coils are tapered, so it stops in a position from where it should move into forward direction by default. Because the direction of rotation of this motor depends on the initial position. But it's still there. Sometimes it runs in the opposite direction if you give initial speed in the opposite direction but most mostly it uh, runs in the forward direction you can see uh, reverse again reverse forward goes to fill speed So it operates by you turn one coil and change the voltage of other coil. If there is back EMF in positive direction, it will start going in uh, less than VCC, and then you need to turn that coil on and make the other off. So that is the main algorithm. And uh, we are sensing the coil voltage and also displaying it on the CRO. Okay. You can see. It. As I try to stop the motor, the timing will increase. You can see that. Now I release. It runs at full speed. So the waveform so around 70, 60 to 70 hertz. So that is proportional to the motor speed.